Hi, I'm Kelsey Hutton. I'm an accredited dietitian and sports dietitian. I work with the Parramatta Eels NRL team. I've worked with the New South Wales Waratahs and the GWS Giants. And now I'm working with Fit and Healthy Chef to bring you credible and reliable nutrition information. Let's talk about coffee as a pre-workout. So supplements, particularly pre-workout supplements, are hugely popular in the gym space and among elite athletes as well. It's so easy to go buy supplements, whether that's from a supplement store, online, or we can even get them in grocery stores as well. But how do we know whether it's the right option for us and whether we even really need them at all? So when it comes to pre-workout supplements, the key ingredient that's in there that is helping us prior to our workout is caffeine. So caffeine delays our perception of fatigue, allowing you to work at a higher intensity for longer before feeling tired and fatigued. But do we really need a supplement in order to get that effect? Not necessarily. So coffee also contains a really good amount of caffeine in it and can be a perfectly suitable pre-workout option for us to consume if you are needing that little extra boost before your workout. So the optimal amount of caffeine to aim for before a workout or before your training session is between two to three milligrams per kilogram of body weight. So if somebody were to weigh 80 kilograms and we're aiming for two milligrams of caffeine per kilo of body weight, they would need to consume 160 milligrams of caffeine before their workout. At the end of the day, this all depends on your individual preferences and tolerances as well. So if you have quite a low tolerance for caffeine, you may actually benefit from consuming less caffeine than that amount and still get those benefits of that delayed perception of fatigue. It's all individualized depending on the individual person. So make sure you do touch base with an accredited sports dietitian that can help you find the best option for you.